guys, Steph here. Today I thought that I would do a Korean drama preview for a new Korean drama that's coming out based on a very popular manhwa or Korean comic book called Orange Marmalade. This drama stars Sol Hyun as a vampire girl who goes to high school and she kind of keeps to herself because she's a vampire and, you know, it's in an alternate universe, but Though she doesn't drink human blood, people don't necessarily like vampires, they have a bad stigma. Don't know why they'd have that. But yeah, she tries to conceal her identity. However, she falls in love with a boy played by the very amazingly talented young actor Yeo Jin Gu, who has issues of his own. As in, he doesn't like women because he had a very abusive stepmother when he was growing up, and so he kinda has this whole phobia of girls, but he's okay with her, though he doesn't know she's a vampire. Of course, in any Korean drama, you have to have a love triangle or even a love square because sometimes there's four people who come into play. Actually, a lot of times there's four people who come into play. This is no exception. You have a female third wheel played by Gil Eun Hae, and she plays a girl who's totally in love with Ya Jin Gu's character, but he doesn't show her any interest and so she kind of becomes the female antagonist for a while until she realizes that the main actress, her role, the vampire, that she's a vampire. As soon as she finds out that like this girl's a vampire, then all of a sudden she becomes really protective of her. So I see that as a redeeming quality. As for the male role in this love triangle, you have Lee Jung Hyun, and he plays a vampire as well, who long ago when they were babies, they were destined, they were told, they were promised to like be married to each other. So they're engaged in high school and he kind of likes her, but she doesn't necessarily like him because he's got some issues himself. I don't know about you guys, but I always love Korean manhwas or Japanese mangas when they turn into live action dramas because I think that there's a lot of really fun elements in that. You have really great storylines, especially if they're popular stories, and it's always interesting to see how they play it out in a live action format. That being said, I'm kind of bummed that this one isn't going to be as colorful as the manga, the manhwa itself, because I want to see the girl with purple eyes and purple hair. Wonder why I want that. So that's me. I'm really hoping to check this out. What about you guys? What are your thoughts? Are you looking forward to this drama? Is this a drama that you think that you're going to pass on? What other dramas would you like to see reviewed or previewed? Let me know down in the comments section. Also, while you're down there, be sure to press the like button, give this video a big thumbs up, and subscribe, you guys. That's it. Happy drama watching. All right, guys, gotta be real, frank, honest. This drama is one of my new favorite dramas that are out right now. 